guys, welcome to the first off-season recap. Um, I, so I'm in a new setting. Um, I actually am going on vacation in Avila Beach. It's in Central California. You probably don't know where it is, but it's here. And yeah, so do you know who declined their offer today? DJ LeMayu did. I really feel happy for you Mets fans because you guys finally got the Will Ponds out of there and got a person who just prints money. He's worth $13.5 billion. Like, what the heck? Now, do we know if he's going to make smart choices? I have no idea. He seems like a very nice man and he's not trying to do what the Will Ponds did and try to make money off of being the owners of the New York Mets. He is worth $13.5 billion. He wants to spend that money and make a good franchise. And you know what? He might actually make more money than the Wilpons will ever make and will be a better owner. And he might not even have to try to make money. He will just make it because fans think, oh, there, he's not trying to make money. He's trying to get enough money so that he can reinvest it and still make some money. Anyways, what you've all been waiting for, Marcus Struman accepted his offer. Now, and you know what? You know what's just crazy about this? Guess who said thank you for taking the money? Any guesses? Steve Cohen. So guys, I really think Steve Cohen is good for baseball, good at figuring stuff out at baseball, and he doesn't want to make this into a job. He already has a job during the day. He wants to make the Mets what the Mets need to be. They are in the New York market. They have the biggest market in MLB, or in any sports anyways.